Pain from the iliotibial band can be a real nuisance for patients and difficult to treat. Most often there's an underlying cause or a biomechanical dysfunction leading to this. Although we can use shockwave to assist in reducing the muscle tone and reducing the pain, it's really important we treat the root cause and improve those biomechanical patterns. The great thing about shockwave is how strong the pain inhibition is. It gives you the perfect window of opportunity to do this. To start the treatment for the iliotibial band, we're going to start using the V-actor. Place the larger of the two heads on as it's a much larger surface area. On the tablet, select the program. We use the V-actor to start desensitising the area and working on the muscles to soften them in preparation for treatment. To move on to the next part of the treatment, we use the radial handpiece with the D20 transmitter. The reason for the D20 is we want to work on reducing the muscle tone or tightness, any taut bands or trigger points. Areas in the quadricep and hip that feed into the ITB need to be addressed. Vastus lateralis, perhaps tensor fascia lata, and any other tissues of relevance. Once we've finished using the D20 transmitter and working on the muscles of the thigh and the hip, we can then choose to use the periactor. The periactor transmitters are a set of transmitters that allow us to work more deeply on the fascia. Find the fascia program for the thigh on the tablet. Select the transmitter, push down the black bar and put the transmitter in.